Well, there's a new home this year for the Bassmaster Redfish Cup, Winya Bay in Georgetown. For the past two years, it's been held down in Texas. Our Tegan Brown finds out why they decided to change locations for this year. 10 boats with 20 anglers will make their way into the marsh this weekend to try and catch four redfish a day, all on national television, by the way. But this isn't the first time Georgetown has hosted a big fishing tournament like this one. Our, our, our friends here in Georgetown, they've hosted several Bassmaster events from our college championship to our elite series events. We've had uh, a couple of other nation events, so they know the bass fishing world and we knew they had redfish here. So we're like, let's give this redfish cup championship a shot. With this being the first time Georgetown has hosted a redfish cup, anglers have had to figure out how to navigate the waters and where the best spots are, which hasn't been the easiest, but they said they've enjoyed the new scenery. You know, you just got to come up with a game plan in the short amount of time that we're here and, and just go with what you know. And, and we're going to, if we're lucky or fortunate enough to catch some fish early, go learn some more areas, uh, use the rest of that day to, to go figure it out. But I'm telling you that that this low country marsh is some of the prettiest country I've ever been in. And we're happy to be here. Well, this tournament is smaller compared to events Georgetown has hosted in the past few years. Al Joseph, the director of Main Street for the city of Georgetown, says the economic impact is still there. Plus, he says the area has a unique quality that makes it perfect for any kind of Bassmaster competition to happen. We're the only place on the eastern seaboard of the United States that has a confluence of five rivers in a bay. You don't find that on the east coast of the United States anywhere but right here in Georgetown. So if you want to go fishing, come to Georgetown. So while the Bassmaster Redfish Cup has been in Texas the past two years, tournament director Hank Weldon says Georgetown seemed like the right move for 2023. We've always heard there's good red fishing here. We hear it from our bass anglers a lot of times when they're fishing that they'll catch a good red fish in a bass tournament. So I'm excited to see what, what Winyaw Bay can do and how it can uh, showcase what, uh, what, what kind of world, uh, out here world class. So it should be fun. It's going to be awesome. The tournament officially starts tomorrow and runs through Sunday with those 10 teams competing for that $100,000 total purse. Reporting in Georgetown, Tegan Brown, WMBF News.